Welcome back, Desert Rose here, and I have another word for my lovely Daddy God. I will start with the personal prophetic, the scripture, and then the main event. Hello, right, let's go. God says someone is praying to be put in emergency housing because they are homeless, and he says, wait for the process to happen, but you'll get it. God says someone is asking him for a new car, and he says, you will get one, and it will be better than what you were expecting. God says, someone is saying it's, he's saying it's time to get your passport in order because he's about to get you to get plane kit tickets. God says he wants his children to pray more and to not give up. It affects not just you. Second Peter three eighteen, but grow in grace and knowledge of our Lord and Saviour Jesus Christ to to him be the glory both now and forever. Amen. Hebrews six one. Therefore let us move beyond the elementary teachings about Christ and be taken forward to maturity, not laying again the foundation of repentance from acts that lead to death and of faith in God. Colossians 1 9 and 10. For this reason, since the day we heard about you, we have not stopped praying for you. We continually ask God to fill you with the knowledge of his will through the wisdom and understanding that the Spirit gives, so that you may live a life worthy of the Lord and please him in every way, bearing fruit in every good work, growing in the knowledge of God. Psalm 92 12 to 14. The righteous will flourish like a palm tree. The the will grow like a cedar of Levon. Planted in the house of the Lord, they will flourish in the courts of our God. They will bear fruit in old age, and the, they will stay fresh and green. Ephesians 4, 13-16 Until we reach unity in faith and in the knowledge of the Son, of God and become mature, attaining to the whole measure of the fullness of Christ, then we will no longer be infants, tossed back and forth by the waves and blown here and there by every wind of teaching and by the cunning and craftiness of people in their deceitful scheming. Instead, speaking in truth and love, we will grow to become in every respect a mature body of him who he has led that is Christ. From him, the whole body joined together by every supporting ligament grows and builds itself up in love as each part does its work. Ephesians 4, 20-24 That, however, is not the way of life you learned. When you heard about Christ and were taught in him in accordance with the truth, that is, in Jesus you were taught with regard to your former way in life to put off your old self, which has been corrupted by its deceitful desires, to be made new in the attitude of your mind, and to put on the new self created to be like God in truth, righteousness, and holiness. My dearest children, I will be leveling some of you up soon and bring you to a you high up as you are up on eagle's wings, as you need new challenges in me, and leveling you up means you can learn so much more about me and my love for you and in depth of my laws. So keep seeking me, keep following me, and trying to reach up high to me. With all my love, Daddy God, peace be with you. Thank you, God, for placing this in front of all who need to hear it. If you feel led to sell in the ministry, click the link in the description box below. Not all words are for you, but if you feel it is, take the law for guidance. I am offering free prophetic words and prayer. Email me at desertrose6655 at gmail.com. When I do words and prayers, I will email you back and not a voice recording. Just to make that one clear for you. And like, share and subscribe and we'll see you next time. Bye.